All right, hello everyone. Hunt Rock here. Uh, I'm gonna be back with another training episode. Uh, so today I'm gonna practice my aerial shots. So I'm gonna start with rookie, um, just to get some practice in because it's, um, my aerial shots are my weakness right now. Ooh. All right, let me try it again. So the trick with the aerial shots I'm finding is you wanna go up ahead of time so that you can try and reach the ball and you have more control. Oh, okay, I just tapped it on that one. I'm gonna reset and try that one one more time. Oh, see how it was too low? If you go ahead of time, usually you'll, you're able to hit the ball. <laughs> there we go. Beautiful shot. All right, here we go for my second shot. And I just touched the ball and I got it in. Let's watch that replay. So notice how I started to jump a little bit earlier. So that way I could self-correct um, for any misdirection I might've had. All right, here we go. Ooh, too high, too high. So notice I touched that with the tip of the car, the front. Uh, I'm gonna try and hit it on the back of the car this time. So I'm gonna jump a little bit ahead of time. Oh, I missed it again. So this one seems to be a little bit higher than the other ones that I was doing. Um, but I'm gonna come down on the ball. Let's see if that went in. And it went in. Got lucky on that one. Let's watch that replay. See, I went up and I tried to tap it with the rear of the car, but I ended up touching the middle. All right, here we go. Nice, I got that shot. All right, let's watch the replay. So I came in, tapped it with the middle of the car, and went into the net. Okay, here we go. Jumping, boost, and in. All right. They get a little easier as you play with them. There we go. All right, nice shot. Let's watch that replay. Okay, so I came in and I just touched it with the center of the car. I find that you get the most control when playing Rocket League if you touch it with the center of the car, especially the Batmobile because of how the hitbox is set up. Oh, and I went in. All right, let's watch the replay. All right, so I jumped early, went for it, just touched it, and it went in the top of the net. That would be a really tricky goal to save. So this one I tried to come down on top of the ball, but I ended up hitting the side of the net. So I'm going to try it one more time. And I'm going to come in slightly on the right, jump, go for it, and tap it down into the bottom left of the net. All right, perfect. Okay, here we go, here we go. Jumping, boost, boost, and in. Okay, that was an easy one. All right, let's see the replay. So what did I do? I jumped, touched it with the center of the car, and down it went. Okay, here we go. There we go, that was a beautiful shot. You can see how I hit it off the front of the car. So let's watch that again. So I just tapped it with the front of the car, and it gave it just enough to get into the net. All right, so I got 70% on my aerial train. So if you've been following our uh, my channel, you would have seen that the last time I did aerials, I got 20 to 30 percent. So that's a huge improvement over about two months of playing Rocket League. Okay, so here I go. I'm gonna see if I can get that score a little bit better. All right, so I scored that one. Let's see. Okay, so I went up. Tapped it right into the net. Perfect. Uh, 
All right, I didn't get that one, but I'm gonna retry it. So I won't get a point for it. You don't get a point if you uh, retry a shot, but once I get it in, it's good practice, just like right there. All right, so I saw a tip come up on the screen and they want me to try flipping my car. So I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try that on this one. Uh, I don't know how it's gonna work. I'm still new at uh, doing this. Oh, it gave it a little bit more of a boost going into the net. Okay, so I'm gonna try and flip it downward. Oh, too much power. I'm gonna have to do it how I normally do it. Okay, here we go, here we go. There we go, I got it in the net. Okay, okay. Tapped it in? Yes, bottom left hand corner. All right, that was a beautiful shot. Let's see if I can get this one. This one's a little bit trickier. Oh, I missed it, I missed it. I'm gonna retry it even though I'm not gonna get the point for it. There we go. See, I knew I could do it. Okay, let's watch the replay. What did I do differently? Um, if you can see what I did differently, drop a comment in the comment section below, just for any new players that might be trying to play Rocket League. All right. Oh, and just in the net. The Batman Batmobile that I have when I score a goal, it's kind of like Halloween in the net. Let's, like, let's look at that. Wow, look at that. Look at all those bats. Okay. Ah, nice. I got a goal. All right, so we're not doing too well. I think we were doing better on the last one. But you can see my aerials do improve overall. So I might not get all the shots, but I am hitting the ball a little bit better. All right, let me see if I can get this one in. I think I got it. Oh, no. No, a little bit too high. I'm gonna try it one more time. I know I can get this one. Ah, see, if I tap it with the front of the car, it ends up going in the air. So that's why I like to do my aerial a little bit earlier. So that way I can come down on top of the ball. But the trick is you have to have the correct direction too. So you can see my car is slightly to the right, but I'm gonna try and center it as best as I can. There we go. So you just have to fix your angles as you're shooting the ball into the net. All right, this is gonna be a tricky one. Let's see if I can do it. Did I get it? Did I get it? Let's watch that. Oh, I'll tap it in. There we go. So I don't know if that one really counts. It'll count as a point, but I mean, if you're in a real game, chances are you're probably gonna tap it into that after it hit the ground. All right, last one. Let's see if we can get a goal here. All right, I tapped it, I tapped it. Follow up. Nice, I got it in the net. All right, so if you haven't been following me, um, I have a series of Road from Bronze. Uh, so what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to go from a Bronze to maybe a Grand Champ. So we can see in the aerial training, I got a uh, 60% this time. But you know what, that's still better than 20 or 30%. So I'm at a 60 to 70% um, level when it comes to rookie aerial training, which is a huge improvement over uh, my last video. All right, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, if you like this video, drop a comment down below. Say what you liked. Um, if you didn't like it, let me know how I can improve in the next one. All right, thanks for watching.